Yeah, like Ed said, the wintry mix in the rain luckily finally out of our area and it moved out pretty quickly. Now our main concern shifts to a flash freeze across our area. Now flash freeze can cause problems like black ice and that black ice is most likely to form in puddles like this as that are still lingering on roadways as well as overpasses and bridges like the one you see here. So black ice is possible tonight through tomorrow morning because we're seeing those sub freezing temperatures really just rush in before some of the roads in our area can dry out like this one that we're seeing here. Now our in house model painting our forecast pavement temperatures shows that as early as 8 PM tonight, our northwest counties could see pavement temperatures below freezing. These sub freezing road temperatures will spread across most of the news five area overnight tonight through mid morning on Tuesday. So this means black ice is possible in scattered spots. Now, not everyone will see this black ice, but it is possible, especially where roads still have water on them. So driving will be dangerous in those areas. If possible, the safest thing to do is to stay off the roadways. But if you absolutely have to drive, 